the pouch that I got. Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to be doing a really exciting video. You guys seem to absolutely love my Dagny Dover videos. And with a friend who made a purchase, I had a $25 coupon and I got one year Dagny Dover product. So I'm super, super excited to unbox this with you guys today. I have honestly had this for maybe about almost two weeks now. And I haven't unboxed it because I was waiting to film this video and I've been having like kind of a rough time so I just wanted to be in the right mood and today is that day so let's get started with this video. So if you don't know I have an obsession with Dagny Dover. Um, I discovered them back in 2016 when I was going to start my clinical rotations and my cousin talked to me about them. They have awesome tote bags that have tons and tons of pockets. They're very good for organization. And I thought it was honestly one of the best bags I had found for my clinical rotations that I could keep everything in my bag organized in pockets and it was very comfortable. They were very durable because they were made of canvas. So I decided to pull the plunge and get it. After that, I fell in love with the brand. I got their landed carry-all, which is now my work bag and I have a video of showing you everything that fits in there as well as a review of the landed carry-all. I will leave those in the cards and down in the description box down below. So if you're interested in checking those out, I'm sure you will like it. So I have been wanting one of their pouches for the longest time. And a little bit ago, I think it was in June, I placed an order for a new um, pouch. And this is it. I did a little poll on my Insta stories to have you guys help me choose a bag and this is a lot bigger than I expected. Um, all their products come very nicely packaged. This is their little care card and things like that. Uh, the receipt, it comes nicely packaged. So all of their bags comes with their classic dust bag. It's always in like this camo-ish print. It comes with their logo printed on it and I love these so, so much. Um, so I had you guys help me a vote on a pouch. I was trying to decide between the Hunter pouch and the Lola pouch because I have a few makeup pouches but they're very small or very large and I wanted something that was a little bit sturdier and more durable. And since I already love the brand, I wanted to give it a try since I had $25 off. So the pouch that I got was the Lola pouch. I got it in the ash blue color and this is a leather bag and it's absolutely beautiful. It is definitely way, way bigger than I expected it to be. And as always, it comes with with their nice thick zippers um, with their logo on it. It opens like that. And then you have the inside of the pouch. All of their bags come with these little attachments so you can put your keys on if you're gonna use it like a, I guess like a clutch or something like that. And then it has these little taps on the side that can kind of cinch it down here and then it kind of looks like that this is a little bit since it's leather it's a little bit harder to close in that sense than some of their other bags but overall it's pretty spacious it's like a nice toiletry makeup bag um, I'm probably going to use it as a travel makeup bag because I don't have one that is like this. I have a full on like carry, um, I don't know, it's like a case, like a makeup case with a zipper and it's top handle and all of that. But if you want something a little bit more carefree and things like that, then this is a good option. It has really nice 
leather-like interior too. It has a little pouch over here that has a magnetic closure. And then it has another one back here also with a magnetic closure. And then it has three little um, elastic bands there so you can put lipsticks and things like that. Their materials are usually very good in terms of longevity and also in terms of being able to wipe them clean. So I'm really excited about this bag. Um, I didn't think it was going to be this big, honestly. Maybe I should have gone with the smaller size, but I mean, it's already here. And I don't know, I, I'm really happy. Um, I debated which color to get. I was debating between the Hunter Pink, which is the same material as my Landon, uh, which is the neoprene bag, and this pouch, and I decided for this one because, I don't know, I just wanted to try something a little bit different since I have a lot of things from their neoprene collection and I don't have any of their leather products. Um, and there is one of their bags that I'm interested in, so I wanted to kind of see in a smaller, more affordable product how the material is, how durable it is before making a bigger investment. But yeah, tell me what you guys think. Let me know down in the comments below if you know anything about Daphne Dover. If you do, then what is your favorite product? Have you tried the Lola pouch? I don't know, I'm really, really excited. And I guess once I use it a little bit better, I'm gonna go ahead and do a review video and letting you guys know all my final thoughts after I've used it for a while. So yeah, this was a really short video, guys, but it's an unboxing and I'm really excited. There's really not much um, else to do in terms of this unboxing, so remember to hit the subscribe button down below, give this video a big thumbs up, hit the notification bell, follow me on social media, and leave me a comment below. What is your favorite Daphne Dover product? Thank you guys so, so, so much for watching, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys. Said than done. That guy.